Hey, good afternoon guys. Henry over here at Cliff Jones RV and Tractor in Sealy, Texas. Okay, so I had did a video on the Mahindra 5155, but this one's going to be the Mahindra 5145. 5100 series, uh, 45 horse, four-wheel drive tractor with the loader. Lithic capacity of the front end loader is going to be uh, a little over 3,000 pounds, and it is a universal skid steer attachment bucket, so all you got to do is pull your handles and back up off of it to put your other implement up here that you might need. And it's universal. You're just not bound to Mahindra product. You can put Bobcat or skid steer implements up here also. Pretty beefy tractor. This is going to be your ut utility. Uh, it does have the industrial tires on here, four-wheel drive, easy access to put your fuel in. Uh, it will be a shuttle shift tractor. What that means is you got a high, low, and medium here, four speeds on the other side, and then it's forward, reverse, and neutral from the column. That's right up here. Okay, guys? And there's your ranges. To engage your PTO, right here. Pretty simple there. But this also comes with the uh, 540E or 540. 54E is going to be more like to use that light utility work that you're doing with your uh, PTO in the rear. Okay, this should be your throttle, your RPMs, getting it up where you need it to be. Get your foot throttle right there on the ground. Um, obviously, your clutch is right here. You got your two brake system right there. Your loader handle is in a good position now, so kind of like a joystick, and it already has the button on the back for your your third function kit that you can put on there. You can lock your loader down if need be also, okay? Raise and lower your three points. And then you do have your position control right there in the back, okay? Armrest, retractable seat belt, four-wheel drive is on and off, parking brake, <clears throat> cup holder for that iced tea. Guess one of the biggest things is no DEF, no protective filter, so there's no downtime or regen process on here primer pump they stuck it out here i guess they expect you to be running out of fuel more and more as you're out there working instead of opening the injectors to bleed them out okay All right, air get that air out of the line steel fender steel hood everything in yellow is where you'll check or access check your fluids easy access to your battery loader can be removed if you ever need to remove the loader color coded hydraulic lines there steel Fold over rops, or we could put a sh uh, put them in a uh, shed, garage, or barn that has a low ceiling or low clearance, or we could put a canopy on it for you in the rear. Okay. All right. uh, here's your top link, Cat Two, Cat One hookups on both of these telescopic three point inch arms. Uh, your draw bar is a little different now, it's more beefed up, a bit more safety. One extra remote in the rear. Bell or hook up for a trailer or lights. Cast iron rear end, a rear work light. No DEF or no particular filter, so there's no downtime or regen process on here. And that's where that MCRD comes in at, the Mander Commonwealth diesel system. Has Bosch injectors. Five year powertrain warranty, two year bumper to bumper, and everything else. Have any questions, guys? Let me know. Thank you, guys. Y'all have a good day.